Welcome, Welcome back, back guys. guys. Welcome back to Ash and Akela. Yes. So, so today, get your fucking ass up, you lazy and go to fucking lazy work. Lazy people. It's like no one this generation work these days. I I just can't. This generation. Yeah. Nobody wants to work. Just get your ass up and do the work. Thank you. It's the best advice ever. Thank you. Like she solved every woman that's struggling in business. Yeah. Just she just gets Honestly, her she up is a pillar of our community. Yeah. That is Thank something. You, Thank we you, needed Kim. that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In case you guys haven't already guessed what we're gonna be talking about today, Kim Kardashian um, released a video trying to like promote. I think the video is to promote her show, right? Is it the new Kardashian show? Yeah, the new. Is that what it was? On Hulu. Oh, okay. Not on E no more. So they, her family, got together and they, you know. Talk, made a video yeah. talking, promoting the video. And before we get into it, guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Let us know your thoughts. Don't be afraid to voice your opinions down below and be a part of the conversation. Yes, we love to hear what you guys have to say. Yeah, that's actually the whole point of these vid these videos. Mm -hmm. We want to have a discussion with you on yeah. every post. So mm -hmm. let's get into it. Yeah, let's let's okay. watch it. From the start, we decided that we always wanted to be really open and honest. And I think something that we've always stayed true to is that we want to film really what we're going through. And even if it's not crazy salacious and it might not be oh, something for ratings like some other shows do, we've always stayed true. What? Did you I say didn't it's see not that. for ratings? That's crazy. Wait. That's actually crazy. Did did Chloe just say she they didn't, didn't do things do for, ratings? for ratings? Yeah. You know what is so crazy about them? Like they actually I just like I really wish that they would just be upfront and honest. Like why do you why do you always lie? Stop like you're they're always lying. Yeah, I remember even when they had a reunion and and Kim was like she gets her body by working out and by exercise. Like, what is, is that? It. That's, that's, that's only that you got that body. All your sisters had the exact same body from working out. Like, I don't think so. I don't understand why okay. she would say. Um, they don't do things for ratings. That's They're literally the, known they to be like the media. Yeah, yeah. like. Yeah. like that's, Anyways, that's, that's so bullshit. Let's just continue this six okay. minute video of lies. I think we've learned a good balance of boundaries over the years. Starting to get me started on boundaries. That's a queen of boundaries. We always show <laughs> that was like a back something that we <laughs> That was like a. They hate each other. That was a backhanded compliment. She is so tired of Courtney being like having full all these all these boundaries yeah. that she has. She doesn't want to film all these things. Yeah. She, she like, doesn't want to get, get her started. fucking ass up and work. Yeah. I have the best advice for women in business: get your fucking ass up and work. It seems like nobody wants to work these days. You That's have to, so true. You have to surround yourself with people. I hate. I hate Courtney. No, that's, that's like so that's true. the first thing I picked up on because I love keeping up with the Kardashians. Mm. I literally rewatched the whole series, mm. um, and Courtney and Kim they literally got into a fist fight because yeah. Courtney didn't want to work. Yeah. So she's here saying that's so true. Like, girl, we they totally just... seen you have a mental breakdown because yeah. you didn't want to work. But. Yeah. Okay. And the thing about Courtney though that I have to rate is like she's. Like I feel like she's happy with what she has. Like you know, it's like I don't I don't need to keep mm -hmm, going. Like mm -hmm. I I can just enjoy my life because they're they're so rich. Like you know, they have so much money, and yeah. it's like I understand. Like you want more, and you want to keep going, and like sky's the limit. I get like, that. She definitely values different things. Yeah, they just have different more values. Solo family and a private life. For yeah, her. like not everyone can be billionaire status like you can. And not everyone wants, wants to, to be. be yeah. And I think like like it's okay. Like it doesn't mean you're lazy. It doesn't mean yeah. anything. Like especially coming from someone who as as, as a millionaire like Courtney, like you know, like mm -hmm. I think I think that's good. I think you're I think mm -hmm. she's okay, you know? I think the thing with Kim is she tries to bring her family up with her. And like sometimes she, they're like, no, no, no. Sometimes I'm okay. they're like, I am not you, like yeah. we have different values and yeah. different people at the end of the day, you know? Yeah. So the thing with Courtney is I feel like Courtney knows who she is, knows what she wants. Mm -hmm. Chloe I, I've said it before, like she fumbled her bag, it's but she's trying Chloe. to be I don't know who that is. I don't know who this lady is, to be <laughs> honest. I've never seen this lady in my life. <laughs> that wanna work have a good work environment where everyone loves what they do because you have one life. No toxic work environments and show up and do the work. If you're the smartest person in that room, you got to go to another room. Like you don't I'm sorry, no. These are so like basic answers. I know. And we're, we're just like this is what you're telling us. Like, yeah. We're not more like informative they could, they could, things. They could like, really I've seen us. this quote on Instagram many times. Many times, you know. Yeah, the toxic work environment. Yeah. Get up and do the work. And like, and if you're the smartest person in the room, you need to go to. Like, yeah. That's, like, literally. Like even that's a quote from somewhere else. Like you know. Seen it on Instagram. Yeah. Honestly, but what Kim is saying, like I agree with her. Like no, yeah, there's nothing wrong with what she's saying. I just think coming out of her mouth, mm -hmm. it's like 
can can they just I just really actually want them to be honest for once in their life like like they can you just address what everyone is talking about can you yeah. say like I know I did not start off in the same way a lot of people start off mm -hmm. I know I come from like I, I have a better hand coming into this game and like Insane. a better chance of like r like reaching that like level of success, of success yeah you know yeah. like the richness and all that mm -hmm. she doesn't say she just says I worked really really hard mm -hmm. and and like I, I'm not saying she doesn't work hard like I'm sure she, she has a Absolutely. lot of business she definitely though. works hard you can tell she's she has a great work ethic and mm -hmm. like I actually like him like especially as of late like I like her she changed she did she used to be this very nice girl like uh, very like approachable type of like she vibe yeah, what do you, mean? you didn't get that vibe from like she used nope. to. She used to have that type of vibe, very nice girl pre Kanye, not even pre Kanye during Kanye, and then like after things got sour, like when she started like in the in the later seasons, like I guess she's more confident now because she had like very successful businesses and mm. like she's like obviously matured and grown up, but mm. she's more now she's like more has a more assertive, aggressive, like bitchy really? attitude. That's what I'm getting. Like get your fucking ass up and work. <laughs> Like damn, okay, I feel like I feel like coming from her like her perspective, I'm sure she sees things and like she's always being told like, well you didn't work hard and da 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 da. So she has tired of it. You know what I mean? And I'm sure she's like, no, I do work hard. Please mm -hmm. believe me, I work hard. Yeah, I work hard. Like yeah. I get that. Yeah, but I even get the opposite. I feel like she used to be really selfish, just like self-absorbed and just like. And then I, I think ever since she got robbed in Paris mm -hmm. and had that experience, I feel like her whole aesthetic changed. She was less flashy and like. I wouldn't say like Kim is down to earth, but like yeah. definitely like more, like just more subtle. Mm -hmm. Like you know, and I, I feel like um, yeah, that's I definitely the vibe got that vibe too. But just like on a personal level, like not even physically, mm. just personally, I feel like she's more like more unhinged and like really more aggressive, assertive. Like I don't know, she gives that kind of vibe. Maybe from this clip, I can see that. From the clips, yeah. I'm, like, I'm pretty sure in this season we'll see more of her bitchy side. As you see everything on social media, and you think, oh, it's just a lifestyle, or oh, it's like really quick and easy, and you can just post something, and it's not easy. And success is never easy. So you just, if you put in the work, you will see results. It's Thank you, Kim. It's, no, that's, it's that simple. Like, I gave you the blueprint. Yeah. Now, take it and go. And go build skims now. It's not true. Like, yeah, it's, it's not. not true. Like, you can work really hard at something, and like, it does doesn't work. Yeah, like, you, you know? don't. You know, it's not the same rewarding job as you, Kim. Like there, there are some extreme labor-intensive jobs. People get their ass, they get their fucking ass yeah. up and work and provide for their family, and they will never reach this level of success. Yeah. And I, and I get this is her experience. I, I do think she's talking to business women though, like people who mm. want to be entrepreneurs. Okay. Yeah. So I, I like, I don't think she's talking to the people who like work a regular job. Like obviously, there's going to be mm -hmm. a cap to how much you make. But even still, even if you yeah. go and like work your ass off, it yeah. doesn't mean it's going to work. Because Kim Kardashian, she has the foundation and the backing and the funding. She can Thank literally you. hire people to think for her. You know what I mean? And like, she probably does. She like does. she's not thinking about these things by she herself. She definitely has social media people, uh, she's photographers, a team videographers, everything. a team, like a whole brand yeah. manager. She doesn't even have to. She just has to, to say, overlook and say, yeah, okay, I approve of this. Like, so it's not the same, Kim. Like you, you know, so you much have for your hard work. <laughs> like what? It's completely different. You know, like it's not. And not to mention these people like the Kardashians specifically I know they have a team of people who who are specifically hired to to go on Instagram and seek out things that have not yet blown up have not yet like like things that they can see that will become trendy and that they can jump on and mm -hmm. that's why Kylie gets so much shit because she literally steals from everybody yeah. like her style her her looks and everything like they are like there's nothing creative about them there's like, you know what I mean like they you're, you have, the, you have though, the opportunity to do these things because you like like you said you have the funding you have the team you have the resources to do all these things yeah. her advice is sound it makes sense of course get up and work and like hopefully you'll see success <laughs> yeah but like it's not guaranteed it's not the same yeah uh, um, I was gonna say she is kind of she Kim is Kim was maybe with Kanye mm. but he definitely like reinvented her style and like yeah. she is innovative because of Kanye though. yeah you know like but if it was for Kanye she wouldn't yeah be that like you know that trendsetter that she is now like yeah. people literally dress just like her i remember when um she switched stylists because mm -hmm. i actually like him like i keep i keep up with the kardashian no i love I like love you know show, yeah so like when she switched stylists and her mm -hmm. style like like changed it's because she hired a, a young fashionable person to like 
style her and yeah. dress her. It's like nothing came from that yeah. noggin yeah. that's on top of your yeah. head. This is people she that you hire. Yeah, sure. and if you have the kind of money and resources that Kim has, why wouldn't you? Of be course, you can build a billion dollar you know? empire on like the fine, the already, the already built foundation that yeah. you have. You know, I it's just like different when you're building off nothing. Yeah, you know, so like. It, the the same rules that apply to you don't apply to like the average business the girl lo yeah. looking to like build a business yeah you know? and and like think about like the way you have to motivate yourself as someone who is regular to do mm -hmm. normal things like to go to work to go to school to do like the everyday mundane stuff in yeah. life imagine how much like what motivation do you have to stir up in your body I'm not saying she doesn't struggle with things I'm sure she does blah 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 you know but like coming from like knowing that you have to build up from nothing to something yeah. like that's so much more daunting than like coming from a yeah. humongous platform Bro. where like you like and, and to there are days where like you can literally be like okay i'm not eating dinner tonight because you know? i have to pay a photographer you know like, she's never felt that type of struggle before and so she it, it just doesn't sound genuine coming from her yeah. because you didn't build from nothing and take it how long it took her to come up with like skims and mm -hmm. stuff like i know they had their other businesses Connie but until Hunter. they and until they saw kylie become a billionaire yeah. then they're like oh shit we need to make yeah. businesses off this you yeah. know like I, def I, I definitely feel like Kylie mm -hmm. put a fire under their bum and to even, like work. Even Kylie saying she's a self-made billionaire. Girl! Please, do you not know why? what self-made is? Why, why don't they see the value of just being honest mm -hmm. and being real and like sh like relating to like people? Because they could relate to people. Like, yes, they started yeah. off, like they weren't always as famous and rich as they were now. Like, yes, she had a really successful dad and stuff, but there was still some come up to them. They mm -hmm. still could relate to normal people. I don't you know. You know who does that really well? Who? Bella Hadid. Oh, she seems like such a nice girl. Yeah, she I gives yeah. that type of vibe, and the Kardashians are just like so far away from reality. From reality, and that's why like, people hate them or yeah, like kind of love them because it's like, regardless, they're so far from me. It's interesting mm -hmm. to see your mm -hmm. life, you know. And but also, like, like I, I, every time something about the Kardashians, like something that they do, like that's cultural appropriation or just racism or just like whatever comes out about them, like you really have to take it with a grain of salt because. Like, you don't know if what they're doing is just to start up more controversy because exactly. that's what they want. Because at the end of the day, us, even us sitting here making this video, it's giving her more, it's putting more money in her bank account. You yeah, know, somehow. this is what she wants. Relevancy funds her, you know? Mm -hmm. So, they're just so talked smart. About and they, they are. Like, she they really are. Like, you have the, to give them that. She does she get came her fucking ass up and work. So does fucking Chris. I want Chris to give us the, the blueprint. Because who works hard is yeah, Chris. Chris yeah, has been working yeah. hard from day one. To put all your kids on like that, except Rob. But he fumbled his own Miss bag Payne, too. Rob. Yeah. Poor guy. Mm -hmm. But she, um, what was I going to say? I hate when like 5,000 thoughts go in my brain and I, <laughs> the, like, I can't think of what happened. I say first. <laughs> yeah. I think she's gone, that thought. <laughs> I don't know where. But yeah. Let's start from the beginning. Kim Kardashian, father, a lawyer, uh, stepdad, a uh, Olympian. Mm -hmm. Like... Perfect formula for success yeah. and also like imagine all the people that they knew mm -hmm. like all their relationships and like all the nepotism that went on yeah. you know like her getting gifted a, a freaking a car for her 16th birthday all her siblings too yeah. whenever they turned 16 like she never felt struggle she really never did maybe working at Dash but even then she had the reality show going for her mm -hmm. she had daddy's trust fund mm -hmm. that when he passed away like you know mm -hmm. that was definitely passed down to them too yeah. so it's like she always had a safety blanket and like no having that safety blanket it's different than when you're starting from absolutely nothing do you think like they are so so far removed from reality that they don't even like consider consider that that's what i was thinking like, too i'm like maybe we're saying this as like regular people like we're no, all the way like, down at here her grown age especially as a lady going to law school who knows all these things helping people like i really rate what she's doing now and like it's cool that she's going to school and all these things yeah and, like i just can't Defend give them that ignorance. lie like they're not babies they're yeah. grown adults and like she was, who, she was married to kanye west who literally started like, from nothing you know what i mean like it. it's just I, I i try to think of like why what wouldn't you gain even more from becoming these people who could relate to like the everyday person mm -hmm. and understand that you started off at a different starting point mm -hmm. and like say that when you give this stupid fucking advice but at the same time she said this to stir the pot yeah. she knew if kim kardashian said work hard you lazy yeah. Regular people because work hard. She already pissed. knows that we got pissed when Kylie said the self-made billionaire thing. Yeah. You know, that, that caused a lot of backlash in and of itself. Mm -hmm. So imagine her saying it too, you know? And like, 
this as the saying goes like privilege is invisible to those who have it yes you know this is so accurate here we can try to give them that lie mm -hmm. but no i'm not defending her ignorance at all like no i know i, 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 I know what she's purpose. doing like i know you can yeah. i know what she's doing you're definitely doing i know what she's doing she knew the internet would yeah. explode if she i know said i know you they, and the thing is too like because it's like you know how like like people love to hate them it's so fun to hate them like you know i get it like why would you say that you're so dumb like but she knew what she yeah. Like, like at the end of the day, like like, like I said, this is making her richer, right? So why not? And and their new show is starting just now, so this is yeah. the perfect thing to like like get people talking, get mm -hmm. people oh Kardashian, 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 like in their head. Yeah. Oh, there's a new show. Let me mm -hmm. watch it. Like this is like their blueprint, and we fall for it every time. Yeah. Every time it never <laughs> fails. We we get mad. We get excited. Yeah. I'm honestly excited for this new season. Sorry, I love really? their show. It's just it's, it's good great. TV. Yeah. I, I love reality TV. I so. love it so much. I was gonna say that the Kardashians will never leave our faces. Like now that they they're control kids, the media so hard, bro. There's gonna be a new generation just now. Like they're <laughs> so never much. gonna leave. They're never, and they're just gonna keep getting plastic surgery to look younger and younger. Yeah. Like. Kim's like 40 something. No, she, she looks, she looks the best she's ever looked, you know? to be honest. No. And uh, on the flip side, like what she said is real. Like it's, it's true. Like yeah, but shut up. Will, will give you success, but Not we don't want to hear you say it. We don't want to hear you say we it. We want to hear someone who's actually self-made say that shit, you know? You know? You know how I love? It's different coming from someone who actually earned their success and didn't just build off exactly. success. Exactly. Who's your favorite self-made person? Kanye West. Oh, that's a good Rihanna. one. Rihanna. Like, there's you know? so, many. so many. I don't know why right now I'm, I'm thinking of Issa Rae because like, she oh, just, yeah, she's so too. amazing yeah. and like so humble and mm -hmm. like, you know, I just, mm -hmm. there's so many people we need to take advice from and Kim, it's not you. <laughs> just sit in your richness and just enjoy it and just yeah. stop trying to tell us what to do. That's all. So funny. You know? Yeah. I agree. Do you have anything else to say? That's basically it. Just work your fucking ass off and you'll get what you want. Stop being lazy, guys. It's that simple. You're just lazy. <laughs> she said it's that simple. Yeah. Yeah, if you got a good team in yeah. a toxic work environment, <laughs> like it doesn't, like, you know, like. Yeah, like, obviously I can afford to even have a team. Like, yeah. You know, like. Yeah, oh, you um, can't? Oh. No. Oh. oh. I can't. Oh. I can't. Oh, yeah. you can? Yeah, I can. Oh, oh, oh okay. <laughs> so then you're good. Yeah. You're good. Let us know what happens when you guys get up and work and, like, if you, like, did you guys start if any you see the same, yeah, yeah like, concept? are you a billionaire? Do they know how much that, how much money that is? Like, how much? A billion dollars? Not even a billion, a million dollars even. Like, I think it's super possible to make a million dollars, but that is a lot of money, sales, whatever. It's have, so it's, easy to make two million when you already have a million. Yeah. yeah. That's it. Let us know what you guys thought about this video, what you thought about getting your fucking yeah. asses up and working mm -hmm. and just the kardashians in general do you agree with us disagree with us mm -hmm. let us know your takes and don't See forget you guys. to oh. like comment, comment and, and subscribe. subscribe yes bye bye Mwah.